right, so we are here, my father and I, at the Sands Tennis Courts, ready to take on Bethany and her father, or Lana, we don't know yet who is going to show up. We're gonna take him down, nonetheless, aren't we, Dad? Dad, come on, you're after this. I can't wait to uh, partner up with you on this uh, epic endeavor. Yeah, we're good, team, yeah, because I am actually the star player. Um, <laughs> I've been practicing my skills since I was a wee little thing, like, since I was five years old, you and um, yeah, I worked really hard. My dad put me in the tennis lessons, and um, yeah, I'm just feeling really ready, and they better wash their backs. You never know what you're gonna get with the board. <laughs> Ever since I was a little girl, I wanted to be a professional surfer. And the last three years, I finally got the chance to compete with the best girls in the world. I lost, I won. It was all right there in front of me. Trying to balance it with school and graduating high school and having a boyfriend and friends and, you know, leaving my family at home. I definitely wouldn't be where I am today without those experiences. I'm Chris Moore, and this is my journey to winning my first world title. the second event with a first at the Gold Coast, um, better than my ninth place last year, and I'm feeling really confident. Um, so today they ran the first round heat of the girls and um, I came up against Pauline Adu and from France and Nikki Van Dyke who um, took Jacqueline Zilla's spot since she got injured in a car accident um, and I ended up second pretty frustrated um, just because I couldn't really find I let the other girls sort of get the better of my exchanges and oh, I didn't really feel as confident as I should have been going into that heat and there's really no excuses because everyone in that heat probably has the same amount of experience as I do out there um, so yeah I just um, I come up against Nikki in my next round and um, hopefully I can pull it together and, and figure it out <laughs> here in Victoria, Australia, and um, looks like they might hold us today, so we're going to head back down to comp dad, Mel's in the car, and um, yeah, let's hit it, let's go! We got perfect Bell's Bowl, I broke out my 6-0 Glen Pang, and you know, I got to throw down some, some, some nice big face cars and, and surf like surfing sunset, it was it was awesome.
up right now. And yay, on round three. Going into the final day, somehow I, you know, came down with a serious cold and I have a nasty cough. My, my body's pretty tired. Um, and it's a long road to the final if I want to get there. You know, three half an hour heats and bells is a lot of paddling and a lot of water moving. And so I can only hope that my body can hang in there and, and I can put up a good fight. coming second and taking home a mini bell and Sally, you know, got to ring the big one. For me at that point I was going into New Zealand um, with a first and a second so I, I was super stoked. I'm, I'm in the lead still and um, you know I have a few days to, to rest up and hopefully get over this cold before the event in New Zealand starts.